Hi, you're watching the Times Weekend Preview brought to you by GoNorthGeorgia.com. I'm Savannah King. And I'm Regina Mansfield. I'm the Main Street Gainesville Manager. And we're here on the square in Gainesville where the farmer's market is taking place this Yes, um, we are so excited. The farmer's market is back. Um, in fact, I brought one of our farmer's market bags, which you can get at the farmer's market. Um, it's right here on the square. It's um, every Friday. Beginning this Friday from 2.30 to 6.30 p.m., we have a lot of great vendors here. What kind of things can people find oh here? Oh my gosh, you can find everything from um, any, any kind of produce, everything's local. All of our uh, farmers are within 40 miles of the square, so everything's very local. You'll find everything from um, fresh produce, flowers, we've got somebody that um, processes uh, pork, and we've got somebody that does beef, um, we even have a goat herd for goat cheese. Uh, we've got somebody that spins a llama fur to make <laughs> lots of neat things. So just about everything you find. And what time is it going on again? 2.30 to 6.30. Every Friday? Every Friday, right here on the square. Oh, and there'll be music too this year. So uh, we, we're bringing that back. Steve Thomas is our market manager and he is awesome. Um, so right here you can come down, hang out, get your fresh produce, your Georgia made products and listen to some great music. Also, there's fluxes going on, so we can get yes. some more information from Amanda. Uh, my name is Amanda McClure, and I'm the executive director of the Quinlan Visual Arts Center. And Fluxus, our uh, unique partnership event with seven other venues in town, is happening this Saturday from 10 to 4, Saturday, May 30th. All of the venues are either going to be free entry or reduced rate entry. So that's the first thing for families to know. It's a good day to go out and, and see all the cultural institutions. There will be live demonstrations. There will be refreshments. There are going to be prizes. There will be interactive projects for the children to work on and then the gnome hunt so people are encouraged when they find a gnome to take a selfie with the gnome put it on Instagram and they'll be entered for a prize we have over a thousand dollars worth of prizes if you can't make it to the downtown Gainesville market on the square don't worry there are tons of other farmers markets in the area on Fridays the Brasselton farmers market will open beginning June 5th from 4 to 7 p.m. On Saturday, Jefferson Farmer's Market will open from 8 to 11 beginning June 6th. Clarksville's Farmer's Market opens from 9 to noon, and the original Hall County Farmer's Market is from 7 to noon. The Dahlonega Farmer's Market is open from 8 to noon on Saturday, and then during the week, the Dahlonega Farmer's Market is open from 3 to 6 on Tuesdays, and the original Hall County Farmer's Market is open from 2.30 to 6.30. The Flowery Branch Farmer's Market is open from 4 to 7 on Thursdays. So for more information on events and activities, pick up a copy of Get Out. It's in Thursday's edition of The Times, or you can go online to GainesvilleTimes.com. Thanks for watching The Times Weekend Preview brought to you by GoNorthGeorgia.com. I'm Savannah King.